Okay. So I did my eyeliner while the dogs barked their heads off. And now I'm going to do mascara. And I'm going to show you the Voluminous the Lash Paradise Primer. Okay. Now again, it's white. See how it's white? And I do a couple coats of this. I do like three, maybe. That's one coat. It's so weird to have white eyelashes. I'm like, why are all my eyelashes? And then it looks like you put like white out on your eyelashes, you know? Like you were doing a paper. Oh, that's a glob. That's a glob. Okay. Okay. That's one coat. Go back. Now, but see what happens? I don't know if you can see it. It so, sort of starts to disappear when it dries. And then go back into the second one. It really is, it, it's not as white when it starts to dry. So that's when you know you can go back in. Over here, it's starting to dry out too. Okay. All right. But see how long they make your eyelashes? I mean, look at that. It's crazy. All right. So now we're going to do this is butterfly. Voluminous Butterfly. And it's got two different sizes of brush. You've got like a regular brush on one side and like a comb on the other side. So you put the mascara on with the brush side and then you comb it after you're done. Okay. So I put a couple coats on of this. I'm not shy about mascara. Trust me on that. Because I don't really do false lashes. I've done them, but I... They don't really do them. The first time I have false eyelashes put on. <laughs> well, I guess the first time I had them put on was for one of my kids' weddings. Probably for my son's. No, my daughter's wedding. But then um, I happened to have been a guest on the Steve Harvey show at one point in time. It's a long story. And they threw some false eyelashes on me, and I was like, uh. <laughs> But I asked him, I asked the uh, makeup guy to show me how to do it, and he showed me how to do it. And I did it for a little while, but I don't know. got tired of it. I saw somebody give a tutorial on how to do the magnetic, magnetic lashes. And that was interesting because I tried magnetic lashes and I just couldn't get the hang of them. And I think her tutorial has encouraged me to go back and try that again. So I may do that. All right, now we're going back again. And again, and again, and again. This may be the last one with the applying. And then we'll comb. But you can see, my I had no lashes, as you recall. And now, they're not bad. They're not bad. They're not bad. And I'm not going to do a whole flat iron and everything for you, but I'll comb my hair out so you can see what it looks like. I have, my hair's pretty long right now. And uh, this is how long I'd like to keep it. <clears throat> which means growing out the gray is going to be cumbersome, to say the least. Okay, so this is my hair. See? We've only got a couple, a couple inches so far. This side is like, woo, woo. <laughs> Let 
do you think? Not too bad, right? So I hope that helps you in your makeup journeys. If you have any questions about anything that you've seen, let me know. I would say no sun, number one. The Tretinoin. Tretinoin. That was this stuff. Tretinoin, 0.05 or 0.05%. Number two. The DMAE. Number three. And number four is the Aveeno. Positively Radiant. I'm not being sponsored by anybody. These are just my own personal things. And another thing that I have been doing for many, many years, many, many years, is sleeping on a silk. Not satin, not cotton, not any thread count. Silk pillowcase. So those are all my hints, tips, and tricks, kids. I hope you liked it.